so in today's video we're going to be seeing how much I read in a week. Um, so today it is Monday and I'm currently reading The Song of Achilles. I think I've got about 90 pages left so hopefully I'm going to try and finish it today. It kind of depends what I'm doing but um, that's the plan. And then we're going to see what else I read this week. So I'm actually just about to head out with my family but um, I read a little bit this morning when I woke up and then when I'm about to go out, I always bring my book with me literally wherever I go. Even if I don't read it, I just bring it just in case. So it's going to be going in my bag. I actually got a new bag recently, which I love. It's this little bag here. It's from Amazon and I absolutely love it. pages left of this book i've been crying my eyes out there's literally tears on the page um but i'm definitely finishing it like right now it's now 20 to 5 finished song of achilles i've just sat here and read the last few chapters oh my gosh bawling my eyes out you know when you finish a book and you just feel sad that the story's not over and the characters are now over i'm feeling that right now um, i feel like i really like kind of felt the story um but i definitely want to read cersei which is another one of madeline miller's books so i'm probably gonna buy that soon even though i'm trying not to buy books at the moment because i've got far too many that i've not yet read so just before i give you a book update and then go to bed i thought i'd quickly show you two things i got today so the first thing that i got was some new converse so i went to this like antique shop slash charity shop and i found these converse in my size and they were 18 pounds and on the box it says they were originally 44.99 so these are the converse obviously they're a bit beaten up because they're second hand but i prefer them like this because then they're already worn in and feel comfortable um so they're these gray ones which i love and then the inside is this really cool black checkered pattern um i might even wear these tomorrow actually um but i'm so happy with those also picked up these today from next because at my i've actually got a new job i don't know if i've told you guys but i've got a new job and I kind of wanted to get some indoor shoes for that because they've got dogs that molt everywhere and then I always come home with all fluff on my feet so and a lot of the other people that work there also have indoor shoes. I got these and they're basically just like fake crocs from next and they were only £12 and then this really nice pink colour. That's normal mode, this is sports mode. Okay let's get back to what this video is actually about um so as you know i finished song of achilles today i did like a little mini review on storygraph and um, on my storygraph i gave this a four and a half stars only because i kind of feel like sometimes Patro i don't know how you say his name i say patroclus or patroclus i don't really know how you say it but i sometimes feel like his character could have had a little bit more development that's the only reason why it's not got five stars the story itself the wording um the writing everything else i'd give it a uh, five stars so i really really liked it and i definitely want to reread this because i feel like there was a lot of foreshadowing in this book which i kind of some of it i was like i thought this is foreshadowing something but other bits i kind of noticed once i'd gotten to that part i was like oh my gosh that kind of explains earlier so i do actually want to reread this and then have another tab color for foreshadowing parts and the next book that i have now started is the little coffee shop of kabul by deborah rodriguez i won't read you the whole blurb because it's quite long 
but it says in a little coffee shop in one of the most dangerous places on earth five very different women come together and it's kind of got the, each of them and it says and these five women discover there is more to each other than meets the eye they form a unique bond that will change their lives forever um so i started that today and i've got a few chapters in now so i'm looking forward to reading some more of this tomorrow now i'm going to be keeping track in my journal of how much i've read this week so i read 79 pages of the song of achilles and then i read 40 pages of this so in total i read 119 pages today which i think is pretty good going so that is my reads for today and i will see you tomorrow good morning actually it's one minute to afternoon but um good morning slash good afternoon slash Good evening. Um, it is now Tuesday. I have just washed my hair, by the way. It's not really greasy. I've just washed it. Um, I'm sat here with a cup of tea, One Direction mug as usual. It's actually my second cup of tea of the day. And I have been going between reading my book and watching Jack Edwards on YouTube because he's like one of my favourite YouTubers. I feel like him and Ruby Granger at the moment are my two faves. Hi, um, how many pages in am I? I am 80 pages in. One thing that I'm enjoying about this book is that they'll have like, well so far anyway, there'll be like quite a long chapter but then the next few will be really short, like a few pages each so it's very easy to like kind of have places to stop and start again. So I am back home now from work and I'm just getting ready for bed and I thought I'd quickly update you on my reading for today. Um, so today I have still been reading The Little Coffee Shop of Cool and I read 111 pages today um, which is pretty good seeing as I had to work this evening and I will see you all tomorrow. Good morning everybody so it is now Wednesday and I've actually had to get up a little bit earlier. There is a fly in my car. I've actually had to get up a little bit earlier today because my brother has had to come to the doctors and I've driven him because his eye, we think he's been like bitten or something and it's all swollen and he can't see out of his eye. So I've driven him to the doctors today and I'm going to sit here whilst he's waiting and I've brought my book with me to read. So um, I'm actually like a decent way through now. Um, I read a little bit this morning. I'm going to sit and read some more now. evening i haven't really filmed much today and i don't think i've actually filmed anything of me reading i've had a bit of a busy day today so as you saw this morning i had to take my brother to a doctor's appointment um and then me and my nan went for our brunch and went strawberry picking which was super super fun i came home i went to the gym had a bath played some guitar and i actually managed to read a lot today as you can see i have only got a tiny little bit left in my book and I have just totaled it up and I actually read 196 pages today. Pretty good if you ask me, um, which is probably going to make up for tomorrow because I'm at work tomorrow. I've got work 10 till 5, I think. Um, so I won't be able to read as much tomorrow, unfortunately. Hello, beautiful people. So I've just gotten back from work and the time is quarter past seven. I thought I was finishing at five, but I actually finished at like just before seven. So... I've not really read much today. I read when I woke up because I always read kind of just after or during breakfast. So I read a little bit this morning. My dad is coming round in about half an hour. So I think I'm going to sit down on the sofa for a bit and try and finish my book. So I've only got like 20 pages left of it or something like that. So I have just finished my book and I think before my dad gets here, I'm going to pick out my next book to start reading. Look at that sunset out there. I actually don't know what book I want to read next. I'm not entirely sure. I might have opened my curtains yesterday. I feel like I should read another one of my summer books, but I also kind of want to read a classic. And classics have I got that I've not read yet. I've got Emma, Northern Abbey, Wuthering Heights. Okay, I think I have chosen my next victim. So I think I'm going to start reading Northanger Abbey by Jane Austen, just because I don't know why. I feel like reading a classic, so we're gonna go with this. Hello, beautiful people. So. It is now Friday, if you're still watching this, thank you very much. Um, so this morning I have just gotten back from the gym, well actually that's a lie, I went to the gym and then I went to my nan's and we had some tea and cake which was really really lovely. Um, we had it on her little like cup and saucers and it was really really nice. We also went over to the co-op and I bought a feast um, because Fridays is our chocolate night, so I bought us loads of chocolate for tonight. So I am now sat on the sofa reading my book. I'm currently on page 53, and I'm really enjoying it so far. 
Um, I kind of just felt like reading a classic this time around, so I thought I'd pick up this one because it's quite short. I think it's like, how many pages is it? It's like 180 something pages. Everybody. so it is now saturday and i thought i'd give you the final update ignore her look i just got the shower um but i thought i'd give you the final update for reading this week so yesterday i carried on reading northanger abbey didn't actually read that much yesterday i read about 62 well i read 62 pages um and i've been reading some more so i'm about halfway through now um and i'm really enjoying it so far so all together in total this week i read 526 pages and to be honest with you, I can't really say if that's, if that's like an average week or not because some read some weeks I read loads, some weeks I don't read a lot. But I felt this week was quite good because it was quite a mixed week. Like some days I read quite a bit and some days I didn't. So that was quite good. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this and thank you for watching. I really want to do more kind of like reading vlogs and book inspired videos. If you have any ideas of what you want to see, let me know. And I will see you all very soon. Bye!